so it stays. Ish. Sorry. Sorry people want to beg out, but you had to see that. It's part of being American fat boy, ain't it? It's part of being <laughs> American's reject. <laughs> I'm Alex Little American Reject. We can't all be America's sweetheart, Kevin. Yeah. yeah. Kevin's American. Kevin Reed, America's sweetheart. Why you gotta be so clean cut? <laughs> <laughs> Why they call you the bad boy? <laughs> Kevin kept saying he's America's sweetheart, so I was joking around. I was like, you know what? If you're America's sweetheart, then I'm America's bad boy. <laughs> it was not self entitled. A bunch of people call me America's sweetheart. No one calls yeah, you. Yeah, they go to other schools, though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're still in high school, huh? It's gotta stay. We'll see. What do you think, Leroy? You're the one that's been doing this his whole life. So. It's good enough for cheap labor. Pretty good for Is a there bad anything job? else you would do different? Oh, yeah. oh plenty, but I'll let <laughs> tell you. Well, it's for another time. Yeah, it's for another time. All right here, just to really make sure it's Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This one right here is going to make all the difference. You can get all these guys. Oh, you didn't tie it on right. Sorry, dude. Well, they're the ones sitting at home watching it on the TV. Well, their phone, or however they watch it. Yeah. No. Go right through there. Whoop! Chicken's free. He's on to the wild. Dude, there was like a bunch of deer right here. There's like eight of them. That's Carson. Yeah, I saw him. <laughs> he stopped. He got his yeah, binders yeah. out. <laughs> well, what else is on the agenda? Stays. Stays. <laughs> Stays and bucking bulls. Stays and bucking bulls. Kevin Reed, America's sweetheart. Hi, Mom. <laughs> Willie hates you. <laughs> what the? <laughs> I never said that. He said, oh, man. Your mom's super bad cool. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin's mom. I never said that. Your mom's really sweet. She's not going to like hearing that. You know, you hate her. All right, you know what? She, is she <laughs> proud of her son being a liar? Son being American sweetheart. You just gotta barely put a little album into it. I'm all out of it. Today, folks, mode. I'm educating these these fine gentlemen on how to properly pump some gasoline and two stroke into a lawnmower. How's this make you feel? World went to pot well, when they put safety regulations on gas jugs. Well, I mean, it's, <laughs> it's pretty self explanatory, but I mean, what can you do? You, you know, win some, I, you lose some. You shouldn't really have do. two steps on a gas jug. That's too, too many. You it's, should be able to just. But That's no. what makes out. See how safe it is in? I, I feel good. I mean, it, I'm, I'm here to educate, you know, and that's all I can provide. So, so. now we're going to let him use a chainsaw. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let him show you how to do this. <laughs> that's, that's pretty funny. You guys didn't know that. It was funny. What y'all didn't see on camera is that it, it's it's self explanatory. So we were cracking jokes at Kevin because he didn't, couldn't figure it out, and then Willie tried, and I couldn't figure, Willie couldn't figure it out either. I mean, he's got a point. It's too, too many steps. <laughs> it's too, too many steps. I've never seen a gas jug this advanced. He's America's sweetheart, not America's gas pumper. So yeah. let's cut him a little slack. Kevin Reed, America's sweetheart. Not America's gas pumper. Easy to pour. It's the first thing it says. That's, <laughs> call yeah, exactly. that's false yeah. advertising. Tell them the liars. Look at him tells you the instructions. Just in case y'all don't know. I don't know how to read. They couldn't figure that out. It, well, it has pictures. Can you see the pictures? That's a hand. That's a human hand. Mm -hmm. See, so it's just saying. See, what's this? He loves in the way. Go ahead, try it out. You just gotta put a little more memory oh, into it. Oh, see, that's see where I thought I thought it was like a tilt thing. That won't let you do it. No, no, no. It's a push thing. Mm -hmm. It's still stupid. <laughs> it still sucks. <laughs> 
Hi, my name's Kevin. I'm gonna pull a stump up. Watch out, Gabe. digging to do. Tune in next time. I'm pulling a stump with Kevin. Hi, I'm Kevin Reed and this is part two of pulling a stump. I'm your host Kevin Reed aka America's Sweetheart filmed by Willie Wordle aka America's Bad Boy. <laughs> We're gonna pull it now. Wrong way. Right way. It's gonna go. No, it's not. Come back after a short commercial break. Welcome back to part three of pulling a stump here. With me, I've got my cameraman, Willie Wordle, Eric, aka Australia's bad boy. I've got Gabriel, the heartbeat of Australia. And I've got the new guy, Carson. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm your host, Kevin Reed, sweetheart of America. All right. It should go this time. Oh, I gotta do it. Hold on. Uh, wrong way. Do it every time. It's really in there. The thing about this stump is, it's like an iceberg. The biggest parts underneath the ground, or the water, or who cares? Well, I'd rather pick up wallaby turds all day than mess with this stump, but a man's got to do his job. We've got more digging to do. Come back after this short commercial break. <laughs> Welcome back to part four of Full of the Stump with Kevin. <laughs> Today with me, I've got my cameraman Willie Wordle, aka America's Bad Boy. So I've got Gabe, the heartbeat of America, and we've got Carson. <laughs> and I'm your host, Kevin Reed, sweetheart of America. not self-proclaimed titles they were just given to us and we got to use them I don't know why but... I bet you two bucks she doesn't go two dollars Yeah, 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 yeah. Our Can Am Defender Pro XT here. Alright! Ain't that right, Carson? <laughs> What's your name again? That's Gabe. He's the heartbeat of America. Wouldn't run without him. What are you? I'm the sweetheart of America. You want to get it just right. <laughs> what do I've never heard of you. <laughs> <laughs> Not only are you the sweetheart of America, you're also our safety manager. And I will write anybody up if y'all are being unsafe. Look, I went over this during the safety meeting. Give me some slack.
did we do an intro for part four yet? No, this is this is like part six, buddy. Oh, part. Who cares? All right, <laughs> we're back on the other side of the fence. I'm Kevin Reed, aka the Sweetheart of America. With me, as always, Carson and Gabe, the heartbeat of America, <laughs> and the man behind the camera. As always, is Willie Wordle, the bad boy of America. America's bad boy. America's bad boy. We're not sure who gave us that name, but we're rolling with it. You gave yourself that name. <laughs> hey, you fight down over there, buddy. Carson, this is why you don't have a nickname. <laughs> a lot of slack here on the uh, part four, but we'll get through it and we'll overcome it. Why is this thing still on the ground? Wrong way, as always. Woo! Just reel that puppy on in like a big old bass, baby. Come on! <laughs> yeah, look at her go. She's fighting. Oh, well, we didn't get it. Woo! Go ahead, drag this big old drag and pile. This is money drag right here. <laughs> Come on! You guys want to get in on this picture? It's a big catch. Here, we gotta hold it out real far. Yeah. <laughs> that my life, <laughs> this is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you almost hit Rick. How could you do that to America's sweetheart? Mom, I don't have time right now. Get out of here. This is stupid. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Kevin Reed, America's Pony Boy. Stay golden, Pony Boy. It's America's Shout out to you know who. Shout out to you know who, America's Pony Boy. We're not keeping that. <laughs> this isn't gonna fly. Wait it till corporate hears about it. Flagged, that place is gonna win right now. It'll get flagged for a reason. A really good reason. Give me that camera. Give me, give me that. Give me that. Look how good our stays are. They're keeping they're keeping things keeping things in. What's, uh, what's that about? Hey. Don't get lost in the details, mate. Hey, get away from my stay. You gonna tighten that up? Are you gonna kick America's sweetheart like that? No, you're America's pony boy. No, I'm not. I can't even ride a pony. <sighs> well, I bet you can. You can't. Never never seen one. Keep it down over there, America's lover boy. He keeps calling himself that, and I don't know why. <laughs> you don't even start that rumor. Because we were like, in introducing Carson, he was like, call me America's lover boy. And I was like, what? And he was like, yeah. And I was like, no. And then we kept taking more takes, and he's like, America's lover boy. And I was like, nah. he was like, come on. And I was like, fine. I don't know why he wants that <laughs> so bad, but introducing Carson, America's lover boy. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't bully in the workplace. Welcome to part one of the second stump. We've got to dig for a little bit to get this one's a little bigger than the other one. And so we're going to have to do that. But with me here is America's Pony Boy, Willie Wordle. No, it's no, no, no. Oh. <laughs> and, and Carson, America's You're Lover boy. boy. You're the Pony Boy. And Gabe, the heartbeat of America because it wouldn't run without him. One man keeping the show going. <laughs> and, oh yeah. And I'm Kevin Reed, your host, America's Lover Boy. America's Sweetheart, okay. <laughs> That's not good. That's bad. Check out the rolly though. Yeah, that's bad. I'm America's sweetheart. I only run Caterpillar equipment. Yeah. You wear Carhartt beanies too, don't you? Nope, I lost mine. <laughs> I have a camo one and I can't find it. Cool. Did you lose it in the woods? <laughs> Did it blend in? <laughs> With the nature? <laughs> <laughs> so good. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, this guy's you're, funny. You're so no, dude. Dude, you're this funny. guy's good. You're funny. I was running around just looking for a Carhartt patch. <laughs> <laughs> Pockets filled with holes, money's running low, truck is moving slow, and I keep going old, cause I've been traveling down the road, nowhere to go, nowhere to go, yes I've been traveling. Get one of them You had him, you had him, you were up one. We almost had it. You got greedy. I got greedy. I made all my money back. <laughs> I have 36. Yeah. Oh, you gotta go, Max. Every single time. Begin. Yeah. Right. yeah, big Kev. Oh, you stink. No. You're bad here. Oh, this is the last one after this. All right. That lady was telling me she watched somebody see him for fifty dollars in quarters of shot. Well, they just got us for ten. One card at 25 cents. I'm not gambling. Post game games. interview? Let's go to all. Well, you see, you win some, you lose some, and I guess today just wasn't my day, folks. But, you know, I'm going to pack it up and I'm going to come back tomorrow. Don't see no end in sight. Sundown turns to night. Tomorrow's another day. Wandering away. The bad, bad word guy. We got, we got Kevin Reed, America's sweetheart. Gabe, the heartbeat of America, feels privileged. And uh, Carson, lover boy. <laughs> America's lover boy. America's lover boy. He really wanted it. Now my eyebrows are wet. <laughs> we spent some big money at the past gas station and uh, we lost it all. We lost it all. We lost ten dollars and two points. Did you spend money in there? <laughs> no. <I didn't. laughs> nah. I, I, was, was I was there spiritually. Yeah, yeah, I thought what he was feeling because I've lost several money. Willie gambled away all the money I had on me today. Yeah, it was a high stakes game and we lost, but you know we're still on to the next we one. We don't even have money to get home. Uh, yeah, I don't know how we're getting home. Now we're poor, Willie. Thanks. Hey, man. We're gonna do this. We could have been rich, sweetheart. though. We could have been rich. We been Scared money don't win money. We're using your money next time. Nah, guys, I ain't part of this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I just keep playing the games. <laughs> just here for if you have, if you need advice, just just ask. I've never you're telling me you're not gonna gamble at all in Vegas, Kevin. We're running the same booth together. I mean, I might burn off like a tenner or so, maybe twenty. I'm gonna bring a hundred dollars, and that's it. Hundred dollars. Yeah. All right, deep pockets. Yeah, I got deep pockets, but that's all. I'm, I I don't really have a lot of money to be playing with. We're not all CEOs like you. Yeah, I'm a CEO of a Fortune 500 company. If I own my own massive company, I'd probably burn out some money gambling. But I I promoted you to vice president. I'm just a craftsman. Dude, you're a vice president of a major corporation. I thought that was Don. No, he's the co-founder. You're adding a lot of people into this. He's the co-founder. That's pretty clean, man. I checked to see if there was people behind us first, guys. Because we Kevin's have safety, man. Woo! Gabe. Yeah. You know how many people are dead in there? A lot. All of them. I heard there's a pretty good cemetery. People was are that a joke? To go there. Yeah, <laughs> DB gets me every single time. That's a good one. Gummo. That's Come a good on. one. Oh, wait. Open? This is the factory. Okay. We gotta go to the uh, Oh store. my god. Look at this Okay. Mm. Cool Keep going, place. it's gonna be on the corner. That thing go? <laughs> We've made it. Is it No. He's in Amarillo right now at the WRCA finals. Oh, I forgot his name. Good, how are you? Good, good. good. Thanks, sir. This place is pretty dope. Very nice. Good time. Having fun at the store. <laughs> Filming a weekly. Is that is that right if I film in your store? Um, as long as you pay the dues. <laughs> <laughs> tell, tell us your uh, thought process. You know, I was going through here and I was like, I don't know if I like any of these. And I saw a little light shining at the end of that right there. 
trumpet started going off, and I think there was an angel or two, and then these just slid out from the back. Oh, and yeah. I was like, mm-hmm, those are That's the ones. It. So catch me at NFR, looking classic. Yes, sir. Know your boots. <laughs>